Welcome back to another studio vlog. It feels so weird to be back vlogging again, but I've missed chatting to you guys. This is the first vlog when I've got my new equipment set up, so we're going to be seeing lots of that in the video. This will be my first sort of proper normal working week with the new setup, so hopefully everything sort of gets figured out this week. There are a few things I'm not sure about still. We're going to just muddle through together and hopefully figure everything out. I spent most of yesterday setting up some files for the mini kit and designing the monthly kit. I have a lot of file reformatting to do which I'm going to do gradually over the next few months so it's not too much of a daunting task but there are a lot of files that I need to do. Printed and cut one of the standard vertical kit collections for this week and did some mini kit as well. I really want to do the monthly kit today, I've just made the file for it now and I'm going to send it to print but I need to put a new roll of paper in the printer so I thought I would show you as I do that. So if you didn't see my wide format video, this is the new printer, it's really big <laughs> and it takes 24 inch rolls of media so I need to load a new one into that now. So as you can see I've got 0.5 metres left but that isn't really enough to print and cut anything so I think I have to click on it and say replace paper, yes. I've done this a few times before but not that much so we're going to work it out together. And then I have to open this. How do I do it again? I can't remember. So that is what is left on my roll, this tiny little bit of paper. So I need to take this off the, what are these called? Is it like a spindle or something? vinyl only had a wonky edge because I cut it by the way when I was doing some testing so it does come with straight edges so I think normally it would not cut the edge. So here's a look at one of my illustrator files this is the June monthly kit I now make all my cut lines on illustrator which is so much better than silhouette I really didn't like the silhouette studio software so really happy to be using illustrator. I have changed the monthly kit to now have doodle icons I used to have like the round circular icons but I never kind of updated the monthly when I added doodles to the shop so I've added these ones in now and I really like them compared to the old style. I can't remember where I left you but my camera died when I was last speaking to you and now it's been like five hours. So I'm cutting a June kit now. I've cut some already but I was tweaking some settings and I've been messing around with it for literally hours. These are what the new doodles look like though and I think they're so cute. I love the little bow. I don't know what I would use it for but it's a good general one.
Hi guys, I thought I would check in with you because I've hardly filmed anything for the vlog so far. Basically, Wednesday and Tuesday were just like a write-off. I made so many mistakes. I lost my settings for the cutter and ended up like just I had so many misfits. I couldn't get it to work and I was just really stressed. So I didn't film very much, but I did figure it out yesterday and I'm sort of back on track, which is good. Because I don't really know the new equipment that well yet. I feel like I grasped something and then like something will go wrong and I can't fix it because I don't know it well enough to like know its quirks like I did with the silhouette. Which means when things go wrong, I get really stressed out and I panic and I'm like, oh my God, I'm never gonna get it right again. Um, and yeah, it's been a fun few days. I have got the new coffee shop kit printed though and it looks beautiful. It's so pretty. Like, uh, I just, premium matte kits just look amazing. Like the print quality is just out of this world. Like every time the machine stresses me out, I'm like, Anna, just think about the print quality. It makes it all worth it. <laughs> so for this week, I'm releasing the coffee shop kit, the Daisy kit and the June monthly. So I need to finish prepping those. I've prepped all of the Daisy collection, almost done the June collection. I just need to do the notes kit and then I need to print and cut quite a few of the coffee shops still. But should be fine because I can do all that while I am editing a video that I need to film. Which I haven't filmed yet, but I will film soon. I'm gonna do a pen test on the new paper and just sort of explain a little bit more about it in depth. These are all the pens I've got to test. So I have quite a few, I think I have about 10 here. And these are just kind of like the pens that I think are sort of very commonly used for planning. I obviously don't have every pen. I don't have a fountain pen, but my friend who does have one tested it for me and said it works perfectly. So I can sort of say on good authority that a fountain pen does work. I'm gonna send a few more things to print and cut and then go film that video. Cause I'd like to have it up today. But I haven't filmed or edited it and it's nearly 4 p.m. So I need to get cracking if I want to do that. So you're all up to speed You didn't miss much when I didn't film but hopefully we're back on track now So it's Friday now and apologies that the sun is behind me but it was shining on me and it was so bright and like casting so many shadows so I've sat here instead which is probably not much better but anyway we're gonna make do because this is just gonna be a quick update. I'm printing at the minute so sorry if you can hear the printers this is probably gonna be a recurring theme in vlogs because I do have to like print in advance so that I can cut. I got the video done last night which is great so I'm gonna put that up um, in the next few hours and I need to edit the new release photos and just sort of count up my stock and see what I actually have to list. So I do have some stock just sort of in piles on my desk. I think you can kind of see it, yeah, like here-ish. So I'm gonna count that up and see what I actually have because although I've been printing and cutting most of yesterday and I did a little bit on Monday, um, but most of it was yesterday, don't know numbers or anything because it's like I print in a different layout to what I printed before on the A4 printers, so I don't sort of have an idea of how many I've got. So I'm gonna do that. I need to tweak a few things on the website, to sort of put that it is gonna be premium matte rather than normal matte. And I also wanna add like an FAQ for premium matte stuff in general, just so that I can like direct people there for all the information. I did end up making a little freebie, like I said. It just says, stickers are getting an upgrade. In the coming months, all planner based stickers will be changed into a removable premium matte vinyl. And just explains like how the changeover is going to work so as i'm ready to ship i'll be switching to the vinyl gradually as the old stock sells out but then by the end of july everything should be in vinyl and whatever's left in paper stickers can be put in grab bags i'm gonna get cracking on the listings i don't know how long it's gonna take me hopefully not that long but i'll chat to you in a bit
So new releases went well yesterday. Thank you so much if you placed an order. I really can't wait for you to try the new paper, vinyl, stop calling it paper. <laughs> the print quality is just amazing and I prefer it to my previous premium matte. So to have it as my standard paper is so amazing. Just made myself a drink and I'm gonna do orders today. It is Saturday, but because I kind of lost Tuesday and Wednesday, like with all the issues I was having, I really wanna to work today as well. I'm hoping the new machines will like let me work Monday to Friday and maybe take weekends off in the future. So we'll see how we go, but today I am gonna work on orders. vlog here but thank you so much for watching fingers crossed for a better week next week i feel like i've ironed out a lot of the issues that i had this week so hopefully we'll have a really productive week next week but i'll try not to jinx it <laughs> please send me good vibes if you enjoyed the video please let me know in the comments down below and if you're not already subscribed please consider subscribing to my channel i upload a lot of small business vlogs and planning related content thank you again for watching and i'll see you next week for another studio vlog bye